Let's reintroduce you to the starters for the Philly World Trotting Derby. We saw these Phillies earlier today in race four, and they're back for the second heat. Remember, a Philly must win twice to be declared the champion. Number one, Glide About, owned by Cliff Siegel, C&I Siegel Racing Stable Limited of Brooklyn, New York, was the winner for trainer Karen Garland and driver Steve Smith in that earlier race today, 154, and two was the time for the mile. Number two, Blue Skies Hanover, owned by the Bloodstock Farm and Stables of Saddle River, New Jersey, was seventh for trainer Ron Gerfine and driver Dave McGee. Number three, Alex Hall, owned by Bob Waxman of Hamilton, Ontario, trained and driven by John Johnson to a fifth place finish earlier this afternoon. Number four, Graceful Touch, finished fourth for Peretti Racing Stable of Cream Ridge, New Jersey, trainer Chuck Sylvester and driver Eric Ledford. Number five, Don't Doddle, was third for owner Adelaide Scoglin, trainer John Johnson, driver Andy Miller. Number six, Mom's Millionaire, finished sixth for Lisey's Joe and Joanne Thompson and Barbara Baum of Chesapeake City, Maryland and Davie, Florida, trainer driver Jimmy Tactor. And number seven, Philly at Biggs, rallied from off the pace in the home stretch to finish second, beating the nose for the win in that earlier heat. John Fielding of Toronto, Ontario and Irving Liverman of Hampstead, Quebec are the owners. Jimmy Tactor trains and Cat Manzi is the driver. Derby number five, Don't Doddle, races for Adelaide Scogland, whose father, the late David Johnston, was the patriarch of Stoner Creek Stud in Kentucky that bred so many top standard breads over the years. And Adelaide's late husband, John Scogland, the former chairman of the Minnesota Vikings. And his father, in turn, was one of the original investing owners in that NFL franchise. They are at the post, and the gate's rolling for race eight, the second heat, and possibly the final heat of this Philly World Trotting Derby. If anybody besides Glideabout wins this heat, that Philly and Glideabout will come back later today in race 12 for a two-horse race off. And Mom's Millionaire is off stride behind the gate just as she was in the first heat today. Here they come. They are off and trotting. Don't Doddle had early speed in the earlier trip today, and she does again this afternoon in this trip. But Graceful Touch is going to go with her on the outside, and Glide About settles into third, right where she settled in the opening journey earlier today. They head toward the quarter. Graceful Touch is up to get the lead. Don't Doddle will go second. Everyone settles into single file formation at the quarter. Glide About is third. Philly at Biggs is fourth. The gap of just over two lengths more to Alex Hall. Blue Skies Hanover and Mom's Mill. Millionaire, the distant trailer, 29 seconds was the time for the opening quarter. Graceful Touch leads it by a length and a half. Don't Doddle is racing second by a length. Glide About is waiting patiently in third with Philly at Biggs right behind her in fourth. Alex Hall is racing in fifth. Blue Skies Hanover is sixth, but right there. And Mom's Millionaire last. Here comes Glide About. Moving up on the outside, and Glide About is up to get the lead at the half from Graceful Touch in second with Don't Doddle third, and Philly at Big still fourth, the half in 58 and three-fifth seconds. Glide About leads it by a length into the far turn. Graceful Touch is second, a length and a half. Don't Doddle is third. Philly at Biggs is still against the rail in fourth, and she is three and a half lengths off the lead, followed by Alex Hall, Blue Skies, Hanover, and Mom's Millionaire is last. Glide About leads it by a length and a half as they turn for home. Graceful Touch, second, a half length. Here comes Don't Doddle up on the outside from third. Philly at Biggs is still fourth against the rail. Three quarters and 126 and three. Top of the stretch for Glide About. She leads it a length and a half. Philly at Biggs now swings out toward the center of the track from the fourth position. Graceful Touch is still toward the rail in second. Philly at Biggs is coming fast on the outside and Graceful Touch up the rail to challenge Glide About. Glide About short lead. Philly at Biggs and Graceful Touch on either side. This time... Philly at Biggs gets there, wins it by a length. It's close for second, either graceful touch or glide about the time. One minute, 54 seconds flat. And folks, we are headed to extra innings in the Philly World Trotting Derby. Headed to a two-horse race off, which will go as race 12 later today. And it's going to be Philly at Biggs versus glide about for the Philly World Trotting Derby title. By two-fifths of a second, this is the faster heat. Owned by John Fielding of Toronto, Ontario, and Irving Liverman of Hampstead, Quebec. Driven by Cat Manzi for trainer Jimmy Tactor. How about a hand for Philly at Biggs?
And a lot of you probably remember when Cat Manzi came to DeCoin a number of years ago and won the open division of the World Trotting Derby driving harmonious. And the result is official. Let's see if we get a word with our winning driver, Cat Manzi. I'm going to walk along with Cat Manzi here. Cat, you kept this filly covered up until they turned for home in both heats. First heat just missed by a nose. Your thoughts on the second heat? Did you ever have any doubt? Well, you know, that's a good filly that I beat, but I was a little closer to it this time, and I thought I had a uh, the first heat, but it was just too late. I, You know, I'm expecting good things from her. I think when you won with Harmonious, wasn't that a two- or three-horse race off here? Uh, yes, it was. Any thoughts on strategy? Uh, you know, uh, I think the horse is having a good day, and I don't think the other horse can beat her today. All right, folks, how about another hand for winning for Cat Manzi?